Amy Staten and News 9 Sports. The rivalry be began in the mid-1980s. Coach Dan Spiro at what was then New Hampshire College and Keith Dixon at St. A's. Tonight, quite possibly the final go-around between the two rivals, at least in Division II basketball. St. Anselm College may be moving to Division III next year. So tonight, we may have been looking at the end of an era. They have had some memorable games and they were at it again tonight. St. A's trying to clinch the regular season title in their division. SNHU trying to finish in the top four for the postseason tournament. Let's see how it went down at Penman Fieldhouse. A look at the current day, Keith Dixon and Stan Spira. What a game it was. Second half, Penman and White, Chris Walters with a steal and he takes it in and will throw it down. A big dunk, SNHU trailed by as much as 13. Big in the second half, big crowd on hand, loving that throw down slam. Baseline jumper by Victor Joshua who had 16 for St. A's. They took a six point lead late, but the last six points in the second half scored by the Penmen, including Doc Quays Andrews with a wide open layup. They were tied 62, 62 through regulation. So it goes to overtime. Chris Braley drives and scores with a sweet spin move, ties the game at 66, and ultimately forces double overtime. So we go to 2 OT. A wild shot by Joshua, but Braley there to grab the rebound and score 68, 66 St. A's. But the freshman Andrews drives the baseline up and under to score and tie it up 66 or 68, 68. So this is how it ends. Take a listen. A buzzer beater, the layup by senior B.J. Cartarelli. How fitting a double overtime game between the rivals. SNHU wins 70 to 68. Coach Spiro with perhaps the last victory in the long rivalry with Keith Dixon. Both teams now looking ahead to the conference tournament. Perhaps they could meet in the postseason. The high school basketball state tournaments begin. This is girls division three Belmont at the Kearson.